Rick. Well, the idea of Wisconsin taxpayers paying for students to go to private or religious schools got a not unexpected push today. The Green Bay Catholic Diocese and several area business leaders came out in favor of this voucher plan. Also with the plan to win over the legislative approval. Now the program would boost enrollment at private schools, but public school educators say it would hurt their schools. Fox 11's Mark Leland first told you about the plan last week and tonight has new details. For several months, advocates of private school vouchers in Green Bay have been quietly garnering support, finally now coming forward with their proposal to allow some public school students to switch to private schools at taxpayer expense. We know budgets are tight. We believe we have a good value for the taxpayer. In many cases, the children will be educated um, for lo lower cost and tremendously high outcomes, and we're very excited about that. Not so excited are public education leaders who say results of similar programs elsewhere have been mixed. I really don't think that there is uh, improvement of curriculum or instructional offerings for students. I think it's just moving pieces around. Private school vouchers from the state are worth up to $6,442, far less than the $10,000 district officials say it costs to educate each pupil in Green Bay schools. That's money the district will lose, but public schools take care of special needs students, which they say escalate the costs, and those costs won't go away. Well, with fewer dollars, we're going to have fewer resources. We'll probably have fewer teachers. Therefore, the education of our students are not going to be there. School choice will make a big difference in our community. Local school choice organizers hope to get the proposal included in the upcoming state budget to roll out the program this fall. Guards group handed out this sheet with area lawmakers' names on it, encouraging supporters to give them a call to support the plan in the legislature. Those opposed to the voucher plan also are encouraging residents to call their lawmakers. Yes, call your legislators and let them know that your taxpayer dollars should go to public education. To be eligible, students must reside in the Green Bay School District and family income must not exceed roughly $67,000 a year. Public school students can switch anytime, while those currently enrolled in private school can only qualify entering kindergarten or high school. And when private school students become eligible, that's an added cost to taxpayers. In Green Bay, Mark Leland, Fox 11 News. Now, a similar school voucher program has been operating in the Milwaukee School District for 20 years.